a couple yeah. of guys I knew had uh, dogs in their uh, vet said, you know, these are more wolf than air dog. And they go, oh, yeah. And they were just quite a smart animal. Oh, yeah. He was saying that the one guy had his uh, dogs on the his He was in the collars in the yard. And they would go up to the line where the collar would beep, and they'd sit down there and lay there until their battery wore out. And then they'd take off. Really? They didn't hurt any kids or anything yeah. like that. And there was this pair of them. He said, and then the, they were behind a church here, and they had the chain, and the kids were screwing with them. So they stayed back until the kids got up close enough, and they went, just got around right top of them, held them down, just stared at It's like, God, doing with us. Yeah, right. <laughs> and it's like, oh my God, they're smart animals. Oh, they're so smart, yeah. One well, guy said he had a hard time keeping them in the cage. He had to concrete it and put them down in, and they were good secure with it, keeping the cage in. Oh, yeah. I have a friend who works for the Wildcat Sanctuary up in Minneapolis. Okay. Like she, like they have all sorts of crazy stories. Like people, are like, oh, I think I can keep a tiger. Like, you know. <laughs> Here, um, my uh, daughter and son-in-law live in Maine. Uh, she went out there to the youth pastor and then ended up meeting and marrying him. And we went to the sanctuary. I think it was in New Hampshire. 